Sadly, the graft of Clara and the hundreds of thousands of other volunteers of the Women's Land Army during the First World War has largely been forgotten. In fact, many of the women themselves didn't talk about their experiences after the war. I wish I'd have known Clara, actually. I think uh, I quite like her spirit. So Natalie has someone she wants to share Clara's story with. Do come in. Hi, I'm Natalie. Pleased to meet you. And you, and you. Clara's niece, Rita. What was Clara like then as a person? Strong. She didn't suffer fools gladly. Right. I know that. But she was so kind with me. And she loved to be outside. Was it ever kind of um, discussed within the family about her Land Army days? I can't remember it, no. Really? Not once. In all her albums of pictures, Rita has only one from Clara's time in the Women's Land Army. I think you might find that interesting. Look, that's Clara. Oh. <laughs> Striking a pose there. Yeah, yeah. That's great. Did you know that she was one of the only female farriers during World War I? Didn't, no, no. It's quite Wonderful. an achievement. Yeah. It was tough work. How does it make you feel about your auntie Claire and knowing that she did this World War I? And... Very proud of it. Mm. Do you know if you could just go back and talk to her? Yeah, because she's very brave. Yeah, yeah. Very proud of her. <laughs> I find this whole experience very humbling. Our country wouldn't be the country it is today without these people, and we have to remember that. It's so important. Whilst Natalie's Emmerdale friends are all preparing their own contributions to the Grand Armistice Street Party... That's the bit I really struggle with, just height-wise. 